All right, we have Elmo now. Go ahead and load your red with your medium brush. And we're going to do a, we're gonna do Elmo here. We're gonna do a U shape, like so, with your red. From here, you're going to do a starburst, just lines, letting your brush flow, like so. A U shape and then lines, and then you're gonna fill it in with some more lines. Like so. Turn your brush around, rotate it, so that all the paint and pigment will get on your paper and not stay on your brush. Elmo's a little fuzzy furry guy. So there you go. Wipe your brush on your napkin. Clean it in your water. Then you're gonna pick up some orange with that same brush. And you're going to color in the U shape into a circle because that is his nose. If it's too watery, dab onto the napkin, pick up the excess water with the brush or tap down the napkin carefully and then there you go, you have his nose. Now we're gonna make his eyes and his mouth. You're gonna take your thin brush with black. You're gonna make a smile line, like a parenthesis, and then another one underneath, depending on how wide you want his, want his mouth. It depends on how far apart you put that design. It's a smile line. Then you're gonna make his eyeballs. His eyeballs are like rounded, letter M. So we're gonna go a C here, and then a C here, so it's like an M. And then you got an eyeball, and an eyeball, pupil, pupil. And there you go, there's your Elmo. Now with eyeballs, you have to be very careful how you place the eyeball because then he looks like mean or happy or sad or scared. So eyes are very important. They'll um, dictate the um, emotion of a character.